Hello everyone, welcome to Six Cats Under by Team Bean Loop. This is a cute little puzzle point and click game I found on Twitter a few days ago, although it'll probably be a week. I don't know, I'm hoping I'll upload this in the next day or two. Um, but no, it's a cute little game about a unfortunately passed away, well, cat lady to be quite honest, as she lets her cats escape out before, you know, they starve to death. And to be honest, this game is super cute. I played about a minute of it, I didn't actually complete it because I just wanted to see it and also to test the recording for it, and it's really cute. It's, 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 it's a depressing one, don't get me wrong, but... Yeah. We unfortunately start off dead. Oh my goodness gracious, how clumsy of me. Reading is more dangerous than I thought. Oh no, what about my precious kitties? Stuck in this apartment, how will they survive? I must get the front door open so they can run free. In my favorite horror movies, ghosts can communicate by influencing their environment. Let me see if there's anything in the room that can help. And we start with a little ghosty. So, we got a pretty big apartment full of all sorts of cute kitties. And I, something I noticed when I was playing for it, they all got names! That's Frederick. He's a very sleepy boy. Usually I can only get his attention if there's a tasty food involved. Oh my lord, it's so cute. I love it. It's so simple. Oh, hello there, Mr. Spock. He is usually quite shy, but catnip turns him into a bit of a rascal. Last week he tore up my new curtains. Ah, oh, Baroness. She sure does like the TV. Especially when I'm watching my baking shows. We got two up here. Hanyo and Clancy. They both love it in the hammock. I don't blame them. It looks very cozy. How the heck did they get up here, though? I mean, I know the whole, there's a whole saying about how cats can get pretty much anywhere, but, like, honestly, how did they get up here? That's Pumpkin. I wish you would try and get along with the other kitties. But there's just no taming that little missy. This is Joffrey. He's such a clever boy, but easily spooked. This might make him the easiest cat to influence. And we got some kitties in here. We got one with a big old bottle. Deborah is probably looking for leftover treats from her last trip to the vet. Rufus, what a cutie. He has the softest fur. It sniffles. He likes chilling in the bathroom. I wish I could give him a cuddle. Oh my lord, though, I never actually noticed how many cats she has. I've been noticing it a little bit more. Wait, is that a cat? I never would have kept all these heavy books if I'd known how dangerous they were. Oh my lord. I, I, I just, like, noticed more of them. I didn't know... Notice, uh... I, no, I noticed those two. I didn't really notice this one or this one, actually. I noticed the one with the butthole, because butthole... <laughs> of course I noticed the one with the butthole, because goodness gracious me, oh my me. Oh dear, what a mess. But never mind that. I need to find a way to help my precious kitties escape the apartment. Okay, I'm, I'm done. I'm done with the voice. What is that? Nothing? Alright. So I'm not actually sure what to do here. Hey, like she said, we can't we can't straight up open the door. We can't do that. We're not strong enough. It's too stiff. I don't have enough strength to open it. This is a job for someone who is still live in the land of the living. Um where to start? Won't budge. Friedrich is tasty food. There's cat food right here. Uh, a bag of catfish food. My ghostly finger. Oh, fish food. Never mind. Uh, my ghostly fingernails aren't sharp enough to rip it open. If this rate even poor Goldie will serve us. We'll starve. Uh, oh, here we go. Well, let us feed Goldie, but it doesn't really do anything. What's this? The sofa was too big for me to move even back when I was alive. I noticed that fly out here. Oh, we got the fly in. 
family photos, precious memories. I do hope my sweet babies find a new home now that I'm gone. I do too. Um... <laughs> okay, SpongeBob. Okay, I guess we can turn on the TV. Uh, there's no way I have enough room, or I have no power to open these doors. Move the fan. Oh, there we go. Turn on the fan. Oh. Hold up. Oh, right, because this one goes crazy for catnip. What 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 is what is this? Wait a minute. Is this it is. <laughs> I wasn't expecting a laugh from that. Oh my lord, okay. That was kind of rubs with- ooh, Jesus. That is- that was- oh, because it'll go to it. What am I planning to do with this, though? Uh, this thing's back. It's too heavy for me to push. I'm sure someone stronger can manage. Uh, I'm not sure what we're doing with the fly. <laughs> oh. All right, because they this one doesn't get along with our cats. Wow, oh, I think that's pick I didn't even notice this one too. Oh, I think there's pickle in there. She's a very fussy eater. Uh, what do you? Okay, obviously it looks like we want to move this cat. Which one is this one again? Joffrey. We want to move Joffrey around. Uh, not sure how we would do that. Oh, uh, you just straight up pushed open the door. Go get a toilet paper. Do what my cat always used to do. That pissed me off. Yeah. Runs away. Oh, I made you run past him. Oh, we touched the fly. Uh, are you gonna go? Go toward him. Yeah. Oh, I don't want to fight him. I wonder. No. This cake is absolutely delicious. This cake is delicious. I really like this cake. This cake is the most wonderful cake you've ever baked. I can't. That's so fucking silly to me. Oh my lord. That's probably like the devs who who are talking in that one all sped up. Um. Well, clearly we gotta keep moving Joffrey around. Where do we want me to go now? Oh, right, Squeaky Toy. Go get Squeaky Toy, Joffrey. All right. Uh. Turn that on. I don't know what that does. Oh, you just knock that over. Oh, cool. Uh, is this a sink? Oh, Duffy doesn't like being up there. Okay, I'm gonna turn that on. That's really loud. Go get the go get sweet toy. Oh, no, I'm sorry, Joffrey. Oh, no. I moved him all the way back. Oh, we gotta make him run all the way back. Good job, Joffrey! <laughs> and I don't think you will hear him afraid. Well, my favorite issue is the cat's weekly. Oh, we gotta... oh, right, we gotta turn this on again. This cake is absolutely delicious. Actually, I wonder. Hold on. I wanna try something.
Ah, there we go. Okay. That was more of just a hunch, because I had to be used for that one. I'm going to assume the SpongeBob one's useless and just a whole reference. Um... What do you want me to do? Oh, wait, hold on. I have an idea. Let me try... Go get the fish! Go get it! Hey! Good job! Run! Oh my god, run! Oh, come on, kitties! Run! Oh, and that's the end. Oh, that was a cute game. That was cute. Alright, as I said, everybody... That, well, that was, that was short. That, that was uh, what I expected when I want to showcase little cute games like these. But, uh, yeah! That was Six Cats Under, uh, once again, by Team Bean Loop. I will leave a description down below. In the description down below, I will leave a link to their Twitter page for the creators, uh, alongside where to actually download this game. Thank you, everybody. I'll see you next time.